Hot coffee. Got our toiletries, hot coffee, muffins, blankets, coats. It's all free. My name is Peter Thomas. I'm the owner of Pilot Pete's Coffee and Treats. And uh, we run Coffee with a Purpose. The idea of the Coats for the Homeless started like seven years ago. Uh, I was trying to find a way to give back and find a way to get the community involved. And I was completely shocked at the uh, response. The first drive we did, we got like over 3,000 coats. The weeks before Christmas was averaging about 200 coats a day coming in alone. So it's like 1,000 coats a week coming in. Yeah, for sure. And, uh, anyone who needs a coat or anyone at all, whoever needs anything, we're always here to take care of them. Ever since he was little, he always would find the outsiders and pull them in to make everybody feel welcome. First things first is we start here, brew the coffee, brew about 20 gallons of coffee. Uh, then after we brew the coffee, we load it up in the car. Hey, How you doing? How are you? Doing good. How are you? Congratulations. Thank you. It's so nice to see you. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Doing good. So what are you doing? What's going on? Uh, we got uh, 2,000 coats we're about to pick up, load okay. them up, and then we're uh, going to Chicago. Yay. Yeah. All Pass them right. out to the homeless. You ready to get out of here? All right. We directly donate them to the homeless and go out there on the street and give them one coat at a time with a hot cup of coffee. And uh, so I feel like it's a little bit more one on one, a little bit more genuine. All the real work and time is into organizing and prepping everything, just like rolling all these blankets separating all the hats, gloves, and scarves out of the coats and donations, and then, yeah, separating male, female, small, medium, large. Uh, so here are gift packs for the homeless. We have uh, socks, food, Kit Kats, pens, chapstick, uh, gloves, pretty much everything they need, bottles of water, uh, everything they need to uh, survive the winter. Y'all, we got like blankets, we got coats, we got like a bunch of stuff over there if you guys want to go shopping. It's all free. No, come on up. Yeah, it's all, all men's coats. I got triple XL, double XL, XL. Soft though, feel it. Uh, next we're going to, we're gonna do Lower Wacker. The last time I went there was some young veterans in their 30s, yeah. like a little bit more talkative and like, you know, wanna. Yeah, yeah. Cool. In seven years, I haven't felt unsafe once. I've always felt safe down there. Even going alone sometimes, I still feel safe. You hear the mattress all the way down there? All the way down, turn it on. Hey, why don't we grab the blankets? I'll give you a ride over there. You got, you got it, oh, there you go. There you go. Too bad? I got you. Yeah. All right. How's your day going? So right when we uh, pull up, we usually just walk out of the trucks, announce that we're here, say we have fresh coffee, muffins. Would you like some coffee? Yeah, I'd love yeah. some coffee. So anything they want, we, we make it happen. This is all women's jackets down here. Okay. Socks, hats, gloves. Oh, this one looks brand new. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Good. Yeah, cool. yeah, for sure. You too. Thank you. I lost my job, and then my roommate threw me out within 24 hours. And they didn't, didn't give me a chance to find another job. Just said, "Give me the key. You're out of here in an hour." Eventually, we're going to get housed. We were supposed to be housed by the end of January, so hopefully, we'll be out here. This is not where I want to be. Free cigarettes, y'all. Coats, blankets, toiletries. We got a whole truck out here. Anything you guys want, come in and shop. Where at? Right here. We got a 26 foot truck. All for you guys. Come on by. I had a place, but I'm going through a lot of stuff right now. But everything's going to make its way. But it's going to get greater later. God has me. I love working with coffee because I like using coffee as a tool, a uh, tool of motivation to 
fuel and ignite people to soar beyond their expectations and to soar beyond society's expectations. And with Coffee with a Purpose, it's kind of my way to uh, get people to do that for the good. You know, so I'm fueling them and caffeinating them to do something better and do something that will make them feel good about themselves and people. We all grow together as one coffee family and fly beyond greatness. You know.